Hey guys, it's Sue here and welcome back to my channel. So today is the first day of summer specials, which I'm very, very excited for. So basically I have planned out the summer special week in which I will post up a video daily starting from Monday to Friday so that we can get ready for summer together. So this is going to include like products that help you cool down in the heat, base products that will last you throughout the humidity and the sweat, etc, etc. So it's going to be exciting. I have been preparing hard for this. To kick off the summer special week I have first brought you guys a review on sunsticks I know a lot of you guys are very curious about sunsticks there has definitely been a lot of releases of sunsticks here and there by various brands so I have a couple and I thought I review them for you guys so without further ado let's kick the summer special week off the first product I brought is from in this is their extreme UV protection stick outdoor SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 now this sunstick with titanium dioxide is a physical sunscreen or sunblock and it's actually very very soft matte doesn't leave a sticky feeling at all and gives almost a powdery finish when you apply it on the face so in terms of the formula I think this would be great if you have oily skin or you're outdoors a lot swimming and also even though it has titanium dioxide it actually doesn't leave a white cast whatsoever it appears to be pretty transparent on my skin so I actually have really been enjoying this now let's talk about ingredients for a moment here I know a lot of you guys are interested in ingredients. This sunstick actually has wax in it and they use wax in sunsticks to give you that nice texture when you put it on. However, wax can also kind of clog your pores and it can induce more acne. So if you have a lot of pore issues, this may not be the one for you. This actually hasn't broken me out yet so far, so I'm okay with it. But if you have sensitive skin or you're really concerned about a product blocking your pores, maybe look into another option. The next product is this Make Prem UV Defense Me Blue Ray Sunstick SPF 50 Plus. And I actually ended up really liking this one. This one is a chemical sunscreen and it actually feels like one that is suitable for all types of skin. Probably leaning towards more of that normal to combination to oily skin because it does give a pretty powdery finish and this sun stick also apparently works as a primer and also helps control the sebum level so if you have oily skin definitely check this one out the next sun stick is from Etude House this is the water melting fresh sun stick SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 and wow guys I actually fell in love with this one now this one even though the packaging isn't as great as the other ones what I love about this one is that it has a cooling effect the product itself has a very cold sensation and 40% or I think 50 43 percent of this sunstick is actually water so it's very hydrating but it doesn't leave an oily sticky feeling at all so nowadays it's definitely getting hotter and I just find myself unconsciously reaching out for this just because it gives me a cooling effect just very refreshing to put on not only is this great for all types of skin especially oily skin but also if you suffer from a lot of heat and you're constantly feeling hot all the time especially in the morning I think this may be a great option the only downside to this product is that this is only sold online so I don't know how accessible this product is going to be it's not sold offline it's only sold online but I do think it's a great product so just going through the ingredient list this is like I said 43.2 percent water it has butylene glycol which is a humectant so it's hydrating but not sticky or oily whatsoever it doesn't leave a powdery finish like the first two that I showed you it's just very hydrating and very watery you can definitely feel the cooling water once you apply it on now because this has 40 percent water when I first received this actually there were little clusters of of water like little bumps of water because when I first received this it came in a little packet where it would actually conserve the coolness so I saw that the water had kind of froze at the top and of course I freaked out because I didn't know what it was but after a couple of swipes on the hand actually a lot of swipes it worked out fine and I've just been using this all the time the next two products are from Vanilla Cool, and this is the hello sunny essence sunstick and I have one in fresh and moist and I'm gonna start with the fresh because I like this one better. Now this is a chemical sunscreen. It has a powdery finish. Mind you, the powdery finish isn't as par or up to the Innisfree one. This one is really, really 
powdery, it's very matte. This one has, you can definitely feel a little bit of that sun cream feeling to it. It's a little bit oily, but not too bad. It's not too bad, guys. So I think this would be great if you have normal to combination skin, not necessarily oily skin. This product also has apple mint, which is apparently great for your pores, and it also has a function of a primer as well. And you can definitely feel that once you apply it on your face, you can definitely feel that your pores have been filled and your face is ready to get beat up with makeup. As for the ingredients, apparently this product has is 35% of the very moisturizing essence ingredients derived from 40 different types of ingredients. So basically it's saying that it's 35% very moisturizing. Now on the other hand, the moist version has 65% of that essence ingredient. So this one is definitely much more moist and it glides on much more smoothly. This is definitely a product for dry skin or normal skin. The ingredient list for both of these products are pretty long so if you have maybe sensitive skin or you're very wary or cautious of different types of ingredients maybe you want to look for another one but these weren't actually that bad. I like the slim packaging. They were very easy to use and just put on so not too shabby. Not too shabby. The last sunstick I have here is the Labiat Blue Safety Sun Stick. This is a chemical sunscreen. Now I actually love the blue safety sun gel which is like in the blue bottle and I showed it in my sun cream recommendations quite a while ago and so I reviewed the sun stick because it looks very interesting as well. Wow this one is definitely hydrating. I definitely recommend this to dry skin. If you have oily skin this will feel a bit heavy on your skin. It does glide on super well. It has that oily kind of feeling and it's very hydrating and one thing I really liked about this is that it has a rather different cutout to the other ones. The other sunsticks, they just have a flat cutout, but this one has curved one. And I thought that this, in terms of like the application itself, had the best cut up. You can really get into those nooks and crannies of your face and just apply it super easily without really getting stuck. However, as for the ingredient list, this has over 500, yes I said that right, 500 ingredients. Now I don't know about you guys but I'm a pretty simple girl. I don't expect much from a product. Especially when it comes to sunblock, I just needed to block off the UVA, UVB and not be so oily because I have oily skin and not cause any acne. That's the, the I mean, if the sun cream does that, that's a-okay with me. But this one has over 500 ingredients. I, I looked over the list and they have a lot of extracts from, you know, extracts from plants, from flowers, a lot of botanical extracts. So I think they just put that in there just so that they can say over 500 ingredients, which I think apparently has a marketing appeal to other people. But I'm just like, mm, no thank you. Yeah, if you have dry skin, this is, this is definitely gonna do the job. But otherwise... Yeah. <laughs> so this was it for the first day of the summer special. I am super excited guys. I have planned out a lot of exciting things, a lot of helpful things that is going to help us power through summer. So please stay tuned for the rest of the week. And yeah, that's it for today. Please like, subscribe if you want to get in part of the summer specials. And follow me on Instagram so we can definitely hang out there more. And I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!